Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Bad news has struck us. A pyroclastic flood volcano has erupted. Its name is Mount Tongu. Scientists thought it would never erupt, but it did today. Now we'll go across over live to our reporter, Martini. Good evening, Martini. Hello, Zahid. I am here with a man that lost everything. His name is Monaro. What happened today? It's covered in ash. I have nowhere to live. This morning, my house started shaking, and I ran outside. I couldn't believe my eyes. Rocks and ash were flying all around me. I ran to my car and left as fast as I could. I drove to the town hall where many odds had arrived. I didn't have time to take any of my possessions. All I have left is what I'm wearing and my car. I hope this eruption never happen again. It was scary with the noise. I heard what seeing everything destroyed around me. Thank you for speaking with us at this terrible time in our and now we're cross over live to a volcano expert, Professor Taylor from Deakin University. Good evening, Professor Taylor. What can you tell us about today's terrible pyroclastic flow at Mount Tongbu? Well, one of the biggest pyroclastic flow eruptions was Mount St. Helens in the United States. It erupted on May 18th, 1980 and Earth Quake that registered 5.1 on the Richter scale shook the earth. The eruption lasted for over nine hours, but Mount St. Helens and the surrounding environment was changed in mo- moments. Over 150 square miles of forest was destroyed. And for a tip, pyroclastic come from a Greek word pyro meaning fire and klastos meaning broken in pieces. It comes from the Greek word.